Good day everyone, we are group 2 and today we are going to discuss about radio waves, microwave and infrared. Radio waves, microwave and infrared. Radio wave, a type of EM wave that have the longest wavelengths, the lowest frequencies and also have the lowest energy. Radio wave, travel easily through the atmosphere and many materials. Microwave is another type of EM wave with shorter wavelengths, higher frequencies, and higher energy than radio wave. One of the most common uses of microwave is food heating because of its radiation that causes the food to heat. Infrared is also a type of EM wave that is most often associated with heat wave and this range is sometimes called heat rays. It consists of EM frequencies between microwaves and visible light. Waves plays a big part in the new normal. This lesson you will understand how messages in the form of signals are transmitted from one person to another using communication devices such as television, cell phone, and radio. Radio waves are the part of electromagnetic spectrum. It is produced by a vibrating electric current in an antenna and is widely used for wireless communication to send information via radio wave. Transmitting antenna sends out a radio wave to a certain frequency and this is received by a receiving antenna. It is good at sending information to many people. Microwave is the produced by a magneton. It can penetrate through an atmosphere. That is why it is the best use if the broadcast is live via satellite. It is good in sending signals to a specific receiver. For cooking, microwaves are used for heating up the water molecules from the food. Inferred consists of electromagnetic frequencies between microwave and visible light. Inferred radiation of the type of M wave most often associated with heat. All objects emit inferred. Our body radiates inferred and the color of inferred radiation depends on the temperature of the body part emitting the wave. This is why under inferred camera or night goggles, our image appears colorful. A. Radio waves in transmission in radio television. In television, radio stations, electrical signal travel through the antenna that act as a transmitter and convert it to radio waves. The transmitter sends out the radio waves and it travels through the air. Antenna that acts as a receiver captures the radio waves and turns them into electrical signals feeding into radio or television or a telephone system and converts it into sounds that we hear or like that enable us to see picture and movements. B. Wave transmission in cell phone. The network of cell tower that relays the radio wave to your friend's cell phone. When you chat your friend on your cell phone, your phone converts your service into an electrical signal. It's then transmitted via radio waves to nearest cell tower. Radio waves are converted to an electrical signal and then back to the sound that is why we can hear the voice of the person we are talking on with your cell phone. Microwave in terms of A. Microwave in cooking. Number 1. Transformer converts the standard household electricity of 120 volts to around 4,000 volts to power the magnetron, the component inside the microwave from electricity. Number 2. Voltage heats a filament at the center of the magnetron that boils up electrons. The electrons are whirled around by two ring magnets. This creates microwave at a specific frequency, typically 2.45 GHz. Number 3. Microwaves are transmitted into the cooking chamber by antenna. Number 4. Microwave bounce around inside the cooking compartment, eventually penetrating the food, in turn heating it up. Number 5. Microwave doors contains a metal mesh with holes that are small enough 
so that microwaves can escape in. But visible light can so we can see what's cooking inside. Number 6. Most microwaves have a revolving glass turntables that moves the food around like a carousel so it heats ev evenly. B. Microwave in communication. Radio transmission is commonly used in point-to-point -point communications and in deep space radio communication. Infrared color illustration based on the temperature of different body parts. Temperature corresponding color. 28 to 30 degrees Celsius, light blue. 33 degrees Celsius, yellow. 34 degrees Celsius, yellow orange. 35 degrees Celsius, orange. Vipers, pythons, and both have holes on their faces. Called pit organs, which contain a membrane that can detect infrared radiation from warm bodies up to 1 meter away, causing them to see an image of their predator or prey at night. Here's a short quiz for you to learn more. 1. What type of electromagnetic wave has the longest wavelength in the EM spectrum? C. Radio wave. 2. What type of electromagnetic wave is widely used for wireless communication? C. Radio wave. 3. Which of the following reasons best explain why microwaves are used for cooking? D. Microwaves cause water molecules in food to vibrate, producing heat that cooks food. 4. Which of the following devices use thermal imaging device technology to capture infrared light? B. Night vision goggle. 5. What part of EM spectrum can penetrate throughout the thicker layer of the atmosphere. B. Microwave Now that you learn radio microwave in for infrared, here is short learn that you need to learn. Radio wave were first identified with the uh, student by Ger Germany, German Pisic Heinrich Hertz in 1886, the first practical radio transmitter and receiver were developed, developed around 1895 to 1896 by Italian Gulabilemo Gul Macaroni. And radio began began the, to be used commercial around 90, 9, 1092 percent interference interference between user and the mission the emission of radio wave is re regulated by the low oh, oh, oh by the law coordinated by international body called the International Telecom Telecommunicate Union or ITU which allo allocate frequency band in the radio spectrum for the different user. Microwaves cause water and fat molecules to vibrate which make to substances hot so we can use microwave to cook many types of food mobile phone use microwave as they can be generated by a small antenna which means that is phone those need to be very big wi-fi also use microwave infrared radio radi radiation that portion of the electric electromagnetic spectrum that extend from the long wavelength or red and 
of the visible light range to the microwave range. Invisible to the eye, it can be detect detected as a, sen a sensation of warm, warm of the skin. That's all. I hope you learned something from our lesson.